Look at his face. Is that a face you can trust or what? Huh? <laughs> Oh, jeez. I guess that was your accomplice in the wood chipper. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? Honey, there's a spider in your bathroom the size of a Buick. Oh, I'm a man. Well, nobody's perfect. So I'm an excellent driver. You know how to drive? Yeah. Never touch the steering wheel when I'm driving. Do you hear me? Yeah. Do you hear me? Of course, I don't have my underwear. What? If you win, you win. If you lose, you still win. They call me Mr. Tips. The greatest trick the devil ever pulled was convincing the world he didn't exist. I ate his liver with some fava beans and a nice Chianti. Yes! 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 I'll have what she's having. It's for the best. Hey, please! God, I love you. Let's keep going. You sure? Yeah. Snap out of it. I can't. I am involved in high treason. Can I count you in? For anything, sir. Anything is a very dangerous word, Lieutenant. Did you ever kill anybody? I hurt somebody's feelings once. For that line of work, I thought you'd be bigger. Gee, I've never heard that before. A whole American officer so ill-mannered. About 99%. The men are coming to kill her. And we'd better get ready. Ladies and gentlemen, please help me welcome the president and COO of TCL Chinese Theater, Owen Height Kushner. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It is my great pleasure to welcome you here today as we celebrate the incredible legacy of film that MGM has contributed to the world for 90 years. The TCL Chinese Theater and MGM have had a close relationship going back to the early years of the theater, beginning with the 1928 release of the MGM picture, The Trail of Nine. The very first MGM picture to feature sound, The White Shadows on the South Seas, held its world premiere here at the TCL Chinese Theater that same year. In the years that followed, many MGM films played and premiered here, including The Wizard of Oz, Broadway Melody, The Champ, Dinner at Eight, Grand Hotel, The Thin Man, Miss Miniver, and of course, a number of the Rocky and James Bond films. From its very inception as a motion picture studio, Leo the Lion has been the iconic face of MGM, familiar to billions of moviegoers around the world. And like the iconic studio he represents, Leo the Lion has also had a connection to the TCL Chinese Theater. The very first time audiences actually heard Leo roar on the big screen was right here on August 3rd in 1928 for the premiere of The White Shadows in the South Seas. Leo also made appearances in person here in the forecourt twice a day for the engagement of the 1930 Lionel Barrymore directed film The Rouge Song. Leo was here to entertain audiences of all ages with stunts and tricks right here in the forecourt for a whole month. So it seems only natural that in celebration of the 90th anniversary of MGM, 
Leo the Lion will become the first studio icon and wild animal to place his paw prints into the cement here at the TCL Chinese Theater. Here today to help honor the cinema achievements of MGM and Leo the Lion is the chairman and CEO of MGM, Gary Barber. Now, ladies and gentlemen, if you will please help me welcome Mr. Gary Barber. Thank you, Owen. Good morning, everybody, and welcome. It is with great pride and an abundance of humility that I stand before you today to represent the iconic studio, Metro Goldwyn Mayer. Like the enduring legacy of a true classic film, MGM has stood the test of time. 90 years ago, when theater mogul Margus Lowe bought and merged Metro Pictures with Goldwyn Pictures and Louis B. Mayer Pictures, the quintessential movie studio was born. Famously laying claim to having more stars than there are in heaven, the studio launched the careers of such stars as Greta Garbo, Clark Gable, Gene Kelly, Judy Garland, Lana Turner, Spencer Tracy, Joan Crawford, Laurel and Hardy, Jimmy Stewart, Mickey Rooney, Elizabeth Taylor, and the list goes on and on and on. The company's vast library of over 4,000 feature films has garnered over 175 Academy Awards and won 14 Best Picture Awards. MGM is the home to such films as West Side Story, Some Like It Hot, In the Heat of the Night, The Great Escape, the Magnificent Seven, Fiddle on the Roof, The Good, the Bad, and the Ugly, Midnight Cowboy, Raging Bull, Annie Hall, The Pink Panther, Rocky, Rain Man, Platoon, Dancers with Wolves, and of course, the James Bond franchise. In 2012, we celebrated the 50th anniversary of James Bond, the longest running franchise in film history. That same year, we released the 23rd Bond installment, Skyfall, which went on to become the most successful Bond film of all time. That billion dollar blockbuster was followed up by The Hobbit, An Unexpected Journey, making MGM the first studio to have back-to-back -back billion dollar films. Over the remarkable 90 year history, MGM films have been helmed by such legendary filmmakers as Billy Wilder, Robert Weiss, Jerome Robbins, William Wyler, Norman Jewison, Woody Allen, John Sturgis, Martin Scorsese, Barry Levinson, Mel Brooks, Oliver Stone, Sam Mendes, Sir Peter Jackson, and many others. As we move forward into the next chapter for MGM, we are invigorated by our recent successes and look ahead to continued excitement in the near future, including this year's upcoming releases of Robocop, Hercules, 22 Jump Street, and the upcoming third film of the enormously successful Hobbit trilogy, The Hobbit, There and Back Again. Next year, we'll also see the return of Bond for the 24th time. MGM is also proud to have a vibrant and thriving television and digital business bringing quality programming to all screens. Today, MGM has a diverse slate of television series on air, including the hit show Teen Wolf on MTV, the epic drama Vikings on History, and the highly anticipated series Fargo, soon to be seen on FX. Those series complement MGM's extensive library of television content, which includes Stargate, based on the feature film that spawned three hugely successful network series spanning 15 years on television and over 200 episodes. Today, we are very fortunate and thankful to have with us one of the most recognizable and popular stars in the world join us as we celebrate MGM's 90th. We are very proud to have this gentleman as part of the MGM family and could not think of someone who represents the history and culture of MGM better. Sylvester Stallone's contributions to MGM and the company's legacy
cannot be overstated. Rocky Balboa is a symbol of perseverance, resilience, unrivaled stamina, and love. Almost 40 years ago, MGM's United Artists released the first Rocky film, which became an instant classic. The film received 10 Oscar nominations and won Best Picture. Sylvester Stallone, the film's writer and star, received nominations for his worth both in front of and behind the camera. We are currently working together on another film in the Rocky franchise, Creed. Additionally, our collaboration for the stage show Rocky hits Broadway next month after an initial successful run overseas. Thank you, Sly, for being such a strong supporter of MGM and a good friend of ours. It gives me great pleasure to call this giant of our industry to the podium. Follow that. Wow. Very bright, isn't it? Yes, it is. Thank you. Thank you all very much. It's a great honor to celebrate the legacy of the now legendary studio. Once upon a time, this amazing studio employed the finest creative minds in show business, the world's most accomplished writers, actors, celebrated directors and producers found a home at MGM. I did when I was lucky enough to show up with this guy from Philadelphia called Rocky Balboa, and it was born, the character was born under the MGM banner. We may have had the eye of the tiger, but it was the lion that put us on the map. He made it all happen, really. And congratulations to the man, Gary Barber, who has done an outstanding job in restoring MGM back to its former glory. Today, MGM is stronger than ever under his leadership. So I just want to say to Gary, yo champ, keep punching. You got it, dude. Thank you, sir. You bet. Thank you, Sly, for those kind remarks, and we will keep boxing on. There are a few other acknowledgements that I would like to make. We are lucky enough to have with us today some of our legendary producing partners. From E.ON, our partners in the James Bond franchise, recent PGA honorees, Michael G. Wilson and Barbara Broccoli. Also joining us today is Walter Mirisch, whose company produced such extraordinary films for us, like West Side Story, Some Like It Hot, The Great Escape, The Magnificent Seven, and The Pink Panther, to name a few. Welcome, Walter. We also have our partners from 20th Century Fox Home Entertainment, Mike Dunn and Mary McLaren and their team. Welcome. I want to recognize my supportive and loving family who have joined me here today. My wife, Nadine, my three daughters, my three daughters, Terry, Romy, and Dana, and my mom, Anne, and my sister, Sharon. I would also like to recognize some of the key players from the MGM team. Ken Shapiro, John Glickman, Roma Kana, Steve Stark, Chris Eidinger, John Bryan, Dean Stratton, Scott Packman, Michael Brown, Matt Davidson, Cheryl Rodman, Jose Gutierrez, Craig Ruby, and our outside counsel, Chris Brierton. Thank you so much to Kristen Cottage and my longtime assistant, Kim Butler, for organizing this event. Thank you to our board, our shareholders, and last but not Uh, but certainly not least, I employees from all over the world for your endless support and dedication. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now about to turn on the electrified fence before the lion enters the event area. Please remain in your seats. Ladies and gentlemen, the electrified fence is now on. 
Ladies and gentlemen, for the event, a line enters the event area, I wanted to remind you the following things. Photographers, it is very important to please keep your hands to yourself and refrain from shouting and sudden movements while the lion is in the event area. There is no flash photography. Special lighting has been accommodated for all photography needs, and we ask that all guests please refrain from flashes while the lion is in the event area. Please do not leave your seats and move around once the lion is in the event area. You must remain in your designated position. No loud or sudden movements. We want the lion to be able to hear the instructions of his trainer, and we ask that you please refrain from talking. We will have three stages of photo opportunities for the lion on his pedestal and with the talent. You will not be able to request a specific shot. The lion will be moving at all times. With his famous roar, the star of every film, MGM's Leo the Lion is synonymous with Hollywood and filmmaking. It was without a doubt the most recognizable logo in entertainment. And when you hear it, you know something majestic is about to happen. Without any further ado, I present the legendary icon, the symbol of 90 remarkable years in cinema, the king of the jungle, and of Metro Golden Mayor, Leo the Lion.
Congratulations, MGM, on your 90th anniversary, and congratulations, Leo Lyon. So we're going to do some photo ops now, everyone. Thanks. Thank you. 